I am Anil Kumar sharing with you test paper of my student Jaspreet. I want to first congratulate him for getting 100% marks in this test. It is on trigonometry of right triangles. So I don't really have to answer any question here. You look into the questions so that you get an idea of how you can prepare and solve your test paper which could be similar to this. Now here are a couple of questions from page number one. These are all knowledge based questions. So in the first set of questions you have to find using calculator the value of the trigonometric ratios and round them to the nearest thousands. And in the next set of questions you need to find the degree using inverse of trigonometric ratio. Now we have a question based on similar triangles. So you can actually pause the video, copy the question and try it yourself. Let's move on to the next page. So here on the next page we have questions based on right triangle itself. So you need to find the length of the missing side. Copy the question and you can try it out. And in the next one you need to find the angle. right? So, so that is how the paper is. It is kind of balanced paper where you have all kinds of questions which you expect in right triangle trigonometry kind of very first test right here are a few application questions the very first one gives you a triangle and you need to solve this triangle and the next one is an isosceles triangle where the side lengths are given to you and you have to find the missing angle to the nearest degree so you can actually pause the video copy this question and try it out let's move on to the next page where we have few more application questions so these are based on similar triangles so you can copy the question it is triangle ABC and triangle PQR are similar ratio of their corresponding sides is 4 is to 9 if the area of triangle ABC is 80 centimeters square what is the area of triangle PQR well in a similar triangles it has to be square of the square right square of the ratio of the sides so that is what you have to use sides are proportional but the area is squared now here is a good communication question which says create a problem for which you would need to apply the cosine function on your calculator solve the problem and explain each step now if you are creating a problem for cosine function then that means there are two cases one case is when the triangles have or, or when the triangle is given all sides right so it's an acute angle triangle for example where all the sides are given so that triangle can be solved using cosine law another case could be SAS where two sides and included angle is given so give an example which has either one of these two conditions correct let's move on to some more questions thinking and inquiry questions so here is a very popular question on flag pole right the question is a flag pole is secured with a Q wire as shown the Q wire makes an angle of 65 degrees with the ground and is secured 4 meters from the bottom of the flag find the height of the flag pole to the nearest tenth of meter and find length of the wire to the nearest tenth of the meter. Now that is a very common question followed by another very common question, right? What I will also do is I'll provide you with some links which will take you to similar questions. So you can practice very well on this particular topic and score like just breathe. Thank you and all the very best to all of you and I hope and wish that you all get 100% in your test or even more. Thank you and all the best.